I've already played them out on blackmail. Experts cannot establish the age of the fetus, so murder's out of the question, too. Is this true or false? Amy and Chris intended to cause a miscarriage. True, only what they did wasn't a crime. But they didn't know that. Famous law school hypothetical. I shoot a bullet in the heart of a man who appears to be sleeping. Only he wasn't sleeping. He was dead. Am I guilty? Not a murder. But I didn't know he was already dead. I thought I was committing a crime. Chris and Amy thought they were committing a crime. So they had a guilty mind. If not for murder, for... Attempted murder. Learn from your past mistakes, Stone. The fetus wasn't legally alive. Ergo, you can't make it legally dead. Ergo, you can't convict on murder. No one is disagreeing with you, Miss Bayless, but if you read the indictment, your clients are being charged with attempted murder. Same difference. I don't think so. A man buys a pound of sugar thinking it's heroin. We all know it's no crime to buy a pound of sugar, but Miss Bayless, in every jurisdiction in the country, the man is convicted of attempted possession of illegal narcotics. Yes, Mr. Stone, but if your man knew for a fact it was sugar, He's as free as a bird. I hate to spoil your fun, Mr. Stone, but I assure you, after three years of law school, Chris knows how to read a murder statute, and I certainly knew how long I'd been pregnant. She sat there and admitted she killed her own baby. I swear her pulse didn't rise above 60. They knew both the age of the fetus and the law. No murder, no attempt. They have proof? She did have an OB confirm the home pregnancy test, plus our young hero Chris's statement that he knew the statute. Are you trying to tell me that a woman that smart would willingly sacrifice her body? That's hard to believe. Well, Ben and brains are not mutually exclusive. Maybe she was abused, but she was part of this thing from the start. If she couldn't form the intent, if she was acting under Chris's will. Well, you saw her. That baby was no more important to her than a watch, something she could hawk for a quick buck. We gotta go forward with this. You fire an unloaded gun at me, it's attempt. You know that the gun is not loaded, it's nothing. But to be acquitted, I have to prove to a jury that I knew the gun wasn't loaded. Chris and Amy will have to prove that they knew they weren't committing a crime and they'll have to take the stand. Credibility is a question for the jury. Exactly. I open up the slightest hole in their story, I give the jury the opportunity, they'll do the right thing. You want a jury to ignore the evidence? No, Chris and Amy want the jury to look at the law. I'll get the jury to look at Chris and Amy. Law is supposed to be a shield, not a sword. They're despicable, yes. But by letter of the law, they're not guilty. The legislature could never have conceived of anything like this. But wrong should not win by technicalities. You know that yourself. Get these bastards off the street. <laughs>